Okay, everyone, I have been talking to you about comms being next for weeks now, months now. Lots of Twitter activity, lots of LinkedIn activity, all aimed at letting you know about comms v next, telling you about all the great content, the amazing speaker lineup, the awesome list of sponsors that we have making the event possible, all the Microsoft Teams product group members that'll be on site. It is going to be a great event to be sure. Let's take a minute though, to step aside from all the serious components of the event and talk a little bit about one of the more fun components of the event, the attendee celebration. What can you expect at the attendee celebration? Let's start with networking. You're gonna have plenty of opportunities during the celebration to catch up with old friends in the industry, to make new connections, IT pros, decision makers, all people that work in the same relative space that you work in. That is why you are there at a focus conference to make those connections and get all the content that you care about. Next up, there is the ability to network with each and every one of the sponsors. This party will be taking place on the expo floor. All the booths will be open. All of our sponsors will be there. There are new Microsoft Teams devices that will be on display. E911 solutions, attendant console options, any type of service and solution that you can think of to enhance a Microsoft UC environment, you're likely gonna find a sponsor for that on the floor. So it is a great opportunity to make the rounds and find out what options are available to you and your organization. Food and beverages. What would a party be without great food and beverage options? There will be plenty of light appetizer or d'oeuvre options out there, allowing you to catch a quick bite while you're making the rounds. And then of course, we'll have plenty of options on the drinks side of things. We'll be handing out tickets for the adult beverages. You get a couple tickets per attendee. And then there'll also be plenty of non-alcoholic beverages as well. I don't think that Pat Richard was successful in securing a Captain Morgan fountain. I heard a few rumblings about that. I don't know what that was about, but don't think that's happening. And finally, entertainment. There will be multiple virtual reality stations set up throughout the expo floor. The games are still yet to be decided. Jonathan McKinney is hard at work trying to figure out what the best games are for the event. So there'll be plenty of chances for some good healthy competition, a little bit of fun, mixing that in with the food, drinks, and networking opportunities. The attendee celebration should be a great time. For the attendee celebration and all the other more serious reasons, we know you'll find great value in the conference and we hope that we will see you there in Denver, June 5th and 6th. Tickets are still available at commsvnext.com. Head out to the website now, click on that register button, and we'll see you there next month.